Feeding those on the front lines of the coronavirus pandemic. For the next 12 days, one restaurant on the plaza will deliver meals to city's essential workers. 41 Action News reporter Emma James tagged along for, de for delivery. This is just one of the stops workers at Fogo de Chon made today. The general manager tells me donating food to essential workers, it's just the right thing to do. In Fogo de Chon's kitchen, you can see and smell the Brazilian culture. It's all about family, so we want to make sure that we're incorporating family at all times, even through these challenging times that people are going through. General Manager Tony Heyman says the unprecedented challenges the world is facing is a reminder to lean on those around you. Together togetherness is what's going to get us past uh, this and uh, you know this too shall pass. Somebody is going to, get up. to show the community it stands with them, the restaurant is packing up meals and sending them off to the folks on the front lines. People that are still working just to make sure that people know that hey Fogo de Chão we truly care about everybody in the community. Workers stopped by a local fire station and a hospital clinic Monday. They'll also deliver to community outreach groups. The Kansas City location is joining others across the nation, donating meals for the next 12 days. And then we'll get this. And then we'll While get some this, things so are we'll out of their here. control, uh, Heyman says he and his team have an opportunity to find the light in a dark situation, and they're taking it. You know, out of some bad comes some good, so we're looking for this to turn as fast as possible so everybody out there can get back to work, because I know that's what we all want. In Kansas City, Emma James, 41 Action News.